and welcome to vlogmas day number 13 i can't believe time is passing so quickly oh <laughs> anyway so i'm starting uh the vlog a little bit later today i think it's about 10 30 and i'm just getting ready uh liam is napping and i'm here on the sofa watching other people vlogmases and uh doing my makeup on the sofa and just want to kind of give you a bit of um, info of what's happening today. Today's quite busy day and basically I'm gonna... I have a car picking me at 11.45 and I'm off to a lunch with Declaor, which is an amazing brand. You've probably seen, I've shot a couple of bits, uh, a gorgeous stuff they send me. Uh, you've probably seen on my social um, one of those night bombs I'm using as well from the brand. And... Um, it's going to be an amazing venue in the Arts Club, uh, which is, some of you may know, it's a members club. Um, I think members clubs in general are, it, it's a big thing in in UK. I, I'm a um, member of the Soho Houses and I think it's a, it's a nice concept, especially in places like London where it's so difficult to find somewhere where you can actually feel like you are welcome somewhere where you can feel like home it kind of offers like different things especially like the soul houses i think the whole concept that if, for example shortage house has got the gym uh so i would use their gym and yeah i don't want to go into detail so basically it's going to be an arts club um but i want to tell you a story how crazy it was for me to actually arrange babysitting so my usual kind of uh, babysitter anna that is a student who helps me with Liam sometimes. She is Czech and she's already gone uh, to Czech for Christmas. So when I got the invite, I'm like, I really want to go because it's a gorgeous brand. Um, it's going to be nice and festive. I love the venue and I really want to go, but I don't know how to do it. There's nobody to mind me. And my husband can't really take the day off because he just started a new job. So I'm like, what am I going to do? So I messaged Tyke and I'm like, what are we going to do? So we kind of find somebody. But like, like, I genuinely believe like certain things are meant to happen and literally like an hour later, I've sorted it, my friend Magda that used to help me a lot to shoot on the blog, she messaged me, Eva, I've got time until, um, I've got a lot of time, I'm going to be on holidays, um, so if you want to shoot, because we used to shoot together a lot, and she's very artistic and everything, and we know each other, we've known each other for a few years now, she messaged me, she's off, and I said to her, I said to her, I definitely want to shoot, but also, is there any chance you could spend four hours with Liam so I can go to this lunch? And she said yes, but do you know what's the best thing? She's actually, like, her job is a nanny. So I could not ask for anybody, honestly, like, I genuinely believe if things are meant to happen, you're meant to go somewhere, you're meant to do certain things, you're meant to bump into certain people, it is going to happen. And I was like so over the moon and I was so thankful that the brand also was like coming back and forth, back and forth, because also the part of this was meant to be to come in and have a facial in the morning. Uh, and again, like, I didn't want Magda to be here like since 9am and, you know, like, just didn't want to complicate it and also like a, a blow dry so um the pr team was so lovely and they said i can do it on another day maybe over the weekend or in the evening so they were so flexible and i was like oh my god this is just so so lovely when people understand your circumstances so basically i'm getting ready for that lunch and sorry for rambling around but i just wanted to kind of tell you how happy i am and you know, when things are meant to be, you're meant to be. And I know some people may think, oh my God, it's just a lunch, it's very silly. But at the end of the day, it's a lovely brand. It's a lovely end of the year, you know, to do all these events. And I'm so happy that I can be part of it. There's so many like breakfast events and lunch events where I can't go unless I can take him. But uh, this venue in particular is probably not very baby friendly. The type of event is probably not uh, uh, baby friendly. And it's just going to be great. And... Yeah, I'm so, so happy. On another note, do you remember this gorgeous Shante Kyle um, highlighter I showed you? So that's what I'm going to use first time. It's so beautiful, piece of art. I'm quite even scared to touch it, but <laughs> it looks great. So I'll show you later 
kind of the result of the makeup. I'm not going to do like anything crazy, you know, I rarely do it. Maybe again, kind of striking lipstick, but let's see. So yeah, I'll catch up with you later. Oh gosh, the highlighter is beautiful, right? And I went for quite natural lips in the end. So this is Tom Ford and a Clarins, uh lip liner. So yeah, I'm still in my PJs. <laughs> but obviously I'm going to go in my pyjamas. I'll change, I'll change. And you'll see the outfit. Well, I'll do my best so I can film it. Yeah. I'll quickly okay. show you what I'm wearing. Boring, but I thought again. <laughs> Black is going to be a safe option. And then... If I come back, I've got another event tonight. If I come back, I know I can wear this to both without being too overdressed or underdressed, or at least I hope. So it's this velvet um, jumpsuit over a polo neck in case it's cold. I'm lazy to change a bag, so I'm still wearing the one I wore yesterday, the Chloe Nile. And I wanted to go like for proper kind of high heels, but yeah, I'm going to stick to these Gucci ones just for the comfort and, and probably some neutral coat as well. Oh yeah, and these Chanel earrings. Can you see? Yeah, I haven't worn them for a long time. So I thought it would be quite nice. To and this little monkey just had a bowl of soup. You can see that on his top. But mommy's not going to change it because she just changed him before he had the soup. <laughs> express enough how festive it was the food in arts club absolutely outstanding like honestly i think i'm going to be thinking about that meal for <laughs> for a very long time and a good thing it, it was served um it was basically served more that we can kind of share so you didn't have to choose from the menu so you know there was fish there was like rib eye gorgeous kind of oh my god i can't think that was like the most amazing spinach i think it was definitely the best spinach i've had um just absolutely brilliant and although i don't i'm not like a dessert person like the desserts that were there like oh my gosh like like from another world and i'm home with liam but now soon i have to head off to the Gerland drinks um, I had a nice catch up the, uh, at the Declaro Laundry with my friend Atosa, who you probably remember from the vlog um, when we spent uh, uh, the, the weekend in uh, Nobu Shoreditch. So she was there, and you've probably seen her in the, very briefly in the La Roche Posse dinner vlog as well. So, yeah, great time, great catch up with the PR team, and a lot of really exciting uh, things coming up with Kara Stars and Declaro for. Uh, upcoming year so I'm very very grateful that I could join join them and I found the babysitting in the end and Liam was just fine he slept for quite a bit Magda was saying so that's really good he's now dancing and typing on my laptop as we speak and he knows he's not allowed to do that so I better go there's a little dancer oh. There's a little squat. So 
I'm currently walking across central London. It's freezing. No cabs, no Ubers, and central line is down. So I basically decided to walk in. So guys, I'm gonna have my hair done at the dry bar with Gerlan, and I picked this look. Yeah. 